Okay, this is just a short video to show you how to install uh, the Adobe Flash Player on Google Chrome. Uh, you might need to do this to view uh, videos on YouTube or on the tvtrade.ie website. Okay, Some customers over time have told us they have experienced problems viewing videos either um, on YouTube or our own website. Um, you know, or instructional videos, things like that. And 99.999% of the problems are actually caused by them having the incorrect version of uh, Adobe Flash Player installed. And in general, there are users, not necessarily related to our own site, that do have these problems. So we thought this would be a good video to put up. So we're going to do a series of videos dealing with how to install the Adobe Flash Player on several different types of browsers, okay? Um, mainly, uh, from our own records, we see that the... the um, uh, what you call it? Um, the, most people use uh, one of four browsers to view our website. So it would be Internet Explorer, uh, Mozilla Firefox, uh, Google Chrome, and Safari. So this video is just going to deal in particular with how to install the Flash Player on Google Chrome. Okay. So as you can see, I have Google Chrome open here, and I'm on the Google homepage. So if you just type in Flash into the search box there. The top result uh, brings you to the Adobe uh, Flash Player uh, page where you can download it and install it. And it's free to uh, download and install, so there's no problem there, okay? So just click on the link, and it brings you into the page here now. So you can see there's some information there. Uh, you can read it there if you like. Um, but basically, this is just going to bring you uh, through the process of how to install it. Okay, so we're going to install the latest version of Adobe Flash Player, which is 10.1.1 or 2.64. And it, you can see here it's 2.66 megabytes. Okay, so you just want to click on the yellow download now button. Okay, and then it says, thank you, your download will start automatically. So we just have to wait a second now. And you can see down below here, this type of file can harm your computer. Are you sure you want to download and install the player? Okay, it's just giving this warning because sometimes uh, files that end in this extension here, .exe, can be malicious. But we know this is from a trusted and reliable website. Um, Adobe are one of the biggest software developers in the world. So we definitely can trust these and we want to do this. So what we want to do is click the Save button. Okay, so you can see the graphic down here changes and there's a little down arrow. So if you click on that and then just go open, another box will come up here and it'll say, uh, do you want to run this file? So we do. And then another box will come up and you'll have to agree to the terms of the license agreement. Uh, so you'll tick the little box there and you'll come over here and click install. Okay, it's that easy. And then you just click done. Okay, so what we're going to do now, just to show you, is we're going to go to the tvtrade.ie homepage. And we'll go into, for example, we'll go into the combined digital receivers here. And we'll go to the Edison Argus Mini. Now, on the vast majority of our products, we have... Um, Oh, this is interesting here. An additional plugin is just required to display some elements on this page. So we'll just go install plugin. And uh, it comes up with the Adobe Flash Player plugin needed. Please confirm you would like to install this. So we're going to say get plugin. Okay, so that's interesting now that we have to do that twice. But once we have it done, then it should be fine. Okay, so it's that easy and that quick. Okay, so we're just going to scroll down here a little bit. Um, and you can see we have all these tabs here, like the description of the product, reviews, user manual, how to install, transmitter info, all these sort of things. Okay. Now, within these, you'll see on the vast majority of our products that we uh, actually have loads of video user manuals, apart, uh, as well as the text, obviously, as well. Okay. So we're just going to click into user manual here. If you scroll down, then you'll see just this particular video on how to install an Edison Argus Mini. So if you click the big play button, the video should uh, start playing then. Now, as you can see, my broadband connection isn't the best, so it's just it's just hanging there slightly now. But you get the general gist of it. That's how you install the Flash Player, and um, that's how you do it on Google Chrome. So that's it, beginning to end, how to install the Adobe Flash Player on Google Chrome.